We have reached the first place where there's a gym leader at. And here's the team right now. I went through um, that one cave, the Galler Mine, and um, this previous route. We caught a Meowth. That's pretty much all that actually happened. And I absolutely destroyed everyone in my path. So, oh, that's right. I got to go find uh, Sonia. Yes, that's right. Her. I think she's this way. Oh, that's her dog right there. Yep, I'm on the right track. First, let me see. Alright, I was going to see what they were talking about, but they weren't talking about anything. Okay. Alright, should be... I guess this is the hill that uh, was spoken of in Legends. There we go, here we are now. Thanks, Yamper. Bow, wow, wow. I had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. What is that? That looks like a giant monster. So that geoglyph, what do you think of it? The darkest day. Especially since the portion depicting the black storm has mostly disappeared. A long time ago, a great black storm covered the Galar region. Giant Pokemon ran rampant. But what was that black storm they called the darkest day? What connections does it have to Dynamax? Guess I'm the lucky lady who will be looking into that. Grand sure gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter, and I'll give you a lead card. Milo's lead card. Grass type, gotcha. Yeah, we're going to destroy him for sure now. Two revives, as useless as always, but thanks. Anyway, I could probably go sell it. So, I guess that's pretty much it. Oh, look, isn't this a Pokemon right here? Um, okay, so I'm just going to run through and talk to these NPCs real quick. These guys are talking about that Geoglyph thing. A treasure lies buried somewhere in here. According to the treasure map, the trick to find the treasure lies in the standing stones. Seek yourself three standing stones with grass before the other ones use... What? What is this, Metroidvania? No, I ain't doing none of this. Bye. Alright, um... Oh, we got a dude right here. Not that important. A leaf stone, okay. That's actually really, really good. Well, I mean, eh. well, this is a Nuzlocke, so I'm kind of limited. But in the off chance I do find a Pokemon that could use a leaf stone, that would be very, very handy. I was thinking back to um, my grass types that fainted, but I'm pretty sure Rose Ray needs a shiny stone and Shift Tree needs a dust stone. That would just make sense. I'm just checking out over here to the right. Energy root. Don't know what that is, but I'll take it. Let me guess. I can't go here. Yep. It's team yellow caused quite the kerfuffle. Now the bridge is in a bit of a state. That thing looks perfectly fine to me. Whatever. That's fine. That's just how the... Wait. Ooh, ooh. Oh, no. There's no Pokemon that we can fish for. This would be a new region right here. And I could catch a new Pokemon, but... Uh, there, there's no Pokemon out here. <clears throat> That's kind of unfortunate. Is there anything here? No, it's just a random dead end right here. Oh, an Everstone. Oh, wait, I'm thinking of the Eevee Light. That's still useful. Oh, Brutal Swing. I have no idea what this does, but it sounds pretty strong to me. Let's, uh, let's go check that out right now. Um, 60 power. Oh, that's it. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. Can anyone learn this? Oh, Fear City can. Uh, uh, duh, 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 duh. Uh, uh, payback. Uh, 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 no, 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 no. Maybe some other time. If I need it. Right now, I think we're fine. I think I'm going to absolutely destroy this first guy. Because I even have a, I have a flying type with a sharp beak on it, too. 
but it probably won't even get that far. I think Mochi's gonna absolutely destroy everyone in that building. No cap. <clears throat> it's a pretty small town. Talking about Milo, they're hyping him up. Guess there's nothing really here. Oh, there's another item. Max revive, yet another useless item. Wait, I can't, uh... Okay, yeah, I can't walk over there. Alright, I guess that's literally the whole entire town. I've searched everywhere. It was, uh... I thought it'd be a lot bigger, but, uh... I guess not. <clears throat> Take a look at this, David. The grass gym badge. I got... Oh! What? But I, I literally just saw this man two seconds ago. At the Pokemon Center, and he already got it instantly. Oh, how... Okay, that doesn't really make sense, because Milo is going to need, like... Doesn't he need to go hit up the Pokemon Center? Maybe he's switching out his Pokemon right now. Oh, it's this crazy guy again! Oh, no, this guy's scary. He gave me a Pokeball last time. He gave me a friend ball. What the heck is that? I don't want to be your friend. This guy's scary. Get away from me. I heard that trainer is Hop's rival. I'm standing right in front of you. Well, anyway, let's see. The league cards. Let me see if I got any data on this Milo fellow. Um. Okay. Wait, does it... Oh, okay. This trainer was born as the son of farmers. He has honed his strength, stamina, and skilled as a Pokemon trainer from a young age by working together with his Pokemans. Because of his gentle nature, he has trouble going on. All out on weaker opponents, which is why his gym is the first one for challengers. He always wears his boots as apparently they let him dig in his heels when he needs to. Okay. Whatever. Um, cool. So I'm, I'm going to go destroy him now. Uniform shop. Oh, what? So there's different uniforms? So there's clothes and there's uniforms. Uh, so I could buy something right now, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there, it's just a uniform for each different type. Is there a dragon uniform? No, there isn't. I guess you walk around just normally with this uniform. Whatever. Well, I, you didn't have the dragon one, so I'm not interested. Pokemon markets? I'm sure. Let's grab some Pokeballs while we're here. Actually, I'm going to grab some potions, too. I feel like we're soon going to get to a point, probably by next town, that we need super potions if we're going to get anywhere with our life. Welcome, Gym Challenger. Allow me to help you. Your goal as a Gym Challenger is to complete each Gym mission. Defeat every Gym leader. What's a Gym mission? Oh my god, she just asked. Okay. Wait, wait, what, what's happening? Am I? What am I clicking on? I'm so dumb. Alright, well, I'm not going to get an explanation on this gym mission, but, uh... Something tells me it's just going to be some puzzle or something. Oh, I just changed out. Nice. Well, I guess here we go. Oh, I'm assuming you can't, like... Like, leave. Or something. Or maybe if you do, you have to restart everything. That's interesting. Well, I, I don't... I don't really need to know, because I'm probably gonna... Absolutely run through everyone here. Is that a trainer right there? Does he want the smoke, as they say? That's a lot of Wooloos right there. Oh, wait, no, this is probably the guy that works here. The mission given by Turfield's Pokemon Gym is this. To chase our unruly Wooloo. It was a puzzle. To that blockade we made from our bales of straw over there. That's it? Oh, by the way, you can call me Dan. I serve as a referee and it's also my job to report the results of Ballast to League HQ. Now let the gym mission begin. Just because I'm curious, what happens if I try to leave here? Did you need something? Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I guess if, if I were to leave, I'd have to restart everything. I thought I'd be fighting, like, gym trainers or something, or they're just not any anymore. Okay, well, that was extremely easy. Cool. Oh, I gotta keep moving these monsters. That's a Yamper right there. 
Is that a wild yamper? Do I have to... Is this thing going to attack me? Oh, it's just literally some random yamper that's just <laughs> running around. What kind of gym challenge... Oh, that there is a trainer right there. Okay, cool. I thought this was going to be the whole thing, but finally somebody's about to try my life. It's a shame... Because they're about to get absolutely smoked right now, literally, by my fire type. He's gonna send me packing, that's his job. <laughs> right, right. We'll see about that, gym trainer Samuel. Gossip Fleur. Oh, so this was a grass type. I guess that makes sense. I thought it was a fairy, though, at first. Eh, it could probably pass for a fairy. Oh, yeah, that, this thing is gonna get eliminated right now. <laughs> oh, my God. Man. That thing was easier to take out than those wild Pokemon on the route previous to this location. The Gym Challenger and their per Pokemon are in perfect sync. I think they- WHOA! Pan! Pan's evolving! Oh, this is so exciting. What's she gonna turn into? A bigger chicken, probably. Whoa, what the? There- she's actually flying now. Corva Squire. Okay, cool. We got some new Pokemon data on this thing. It's just a flying type. It's the Raven Pokemon. Smart enough to use tools in battle. These Pokemon have been seen picking up rocks and flinging them or using ropes to wrap up enemies. I thought that was the crow that was supposed to be the smart bird, not uh, the Raven. I'm not a biologist, mind you. There's another Yamper just in the road. Oh, the dog scares the sheep. Gotcha. That's okay. I wanted to fight this guy anyway. Wait, wait. Why? That's weird, like... I remember in the previous video, I was walking on the, the route before here, and some guy saw me over the fence and challenged me to a battle. And yet I just walked right and past this trainer's face, and he did nothing about it. I don't know, that's weird. See, back like a million years ago, you walked in front of a trainer, there was no talking. It was just nothing but smoke. That Badoo just died. Jeez, I've seen a lot of Badoos die, including my own. It's not a good game to be a Badooin. Oddish, okay. I like Oddish. That's actually a Pokemon I could use my Leaf Stone on. It's a shame I don't own one. That'd be a cool Pokemon. I don't think Vileplume's that good, but uh, it'd be cool to have. I've, yeah, I haven't seen a single Oddish. Wait, wait, wait. That's not true. That camp. A couple routes ago. There was a camp. She had an Oddish. My bad. I've never fought an Oddish. How about that? So we're going to move this forward. Is it? Oh, whoa, 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 what the heck? I got a hiccup. Is this the last one? There's probably one more spot after this. I swear, every first gym, there's always two trainers on the dot. Okay, oh, there's two dogs. Wait, there's another trainer, it seems. Oh, okay, yeah, they're going to be all over the place for this one. That's okay. Um, I can just go back and get them. Okay, let me fight this trainer real quick. So I was wrong. There's actually three. The gym leader is just ahead of us. Okay, so this is the last fight. Gym trainer Leah. What does she have? Bounce sweet. What, what is this? What the heck is that thing? What generation is that from? Oh, man. I don't know. I, I've, I swear I've never seen this thing before. Maybe it's a generation 8 Pokemon. I don't think that's Gen 6 or 7. I don't really remember much from anything anymore nowadays, I swear. Oh, she's got an Oddish too. Yeah, I, I knew it. Mochi was just going to run through everyone. Like it's nobody's business. Yep. Take another flame charge. Boom. I wonder what the gym leader's going to have. What would be a strong, reasonable grass type for somebody that doesn't know too much about Pokemon to fight right now? Well, Frank wants to learn Water Pulse. Water Pulse ain't a bad move. Oh, that's right. Frank isn't even um, a water type, so that's not Stab. Huh, that's strange. He's he's not he's not your everyday Slowpoke. He's not, you know, Kanto's Slowpoke, slow poke, as I call him. Even though it's just pretty much a slowpoke from every other uh, location. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I beat the trainer, so the... Oh, she owned those two dogs, I guess, so... Interesting. So now those dogs are being kept in place. 
So this should be easy. I'm actually outrunning the Wooler. Are you kidding me? I hope this is 20. I don't think I missed any. Yep. Oh yeah, that's 20. Now they're all going to use Tackle Attack. And destroy all these bales of straw and wheat. Yeah, that should be it. Yeah, cool, I took care of business. Yay! Alright, so just... I guess Milo's going to be up these stairs. I bet he's, um... I don't know. Yeah, he's got to have at least one evolved Pokemon. Gym mission clear. That was actually really easy. I'm not exactly proud about this. I, I wouldn't go around bragging about it, but that's just me. Whoa, okay, we're actually... Oh, okay, this is a stadium. Forgot about this. It's the real deal. I kind of like that idea in this game. They're like actual stadiums because this game is more of a sport now. He's got six Pokeballs. There's no way he has six Pokemon, though. Okay, well, if Hop beat this guy, like, in less than five seconds, I mean, surely I'll absolutely might wipe the floor with him. The suspense is building. My gym is the first one people face, so we get a lot of challengers. That's why I try to keep the gym mission challenging, but... That was not challenging at all. Sure seems like you understand Pokemon real well. This is going to be a doozy of a battle. I'll have to Dynamax my Pokemon if I want to win. What? Can I Dynamax my Pokemon? That wouldn't seem very fair to me. Okay, this music's pretty good so far. Gym Leader Milo. He's got two Pokemon. The Gossip Lure? Oh no. <laughs> oh, Milo. How oh, level is this thing? Wait, what the? Okay, the Dynamax Phenomena. And the Gala Region Pokemon can become far larger than usual in certain places. This transformation is called Dynamaxing. Press the Dynamax. What? Your Pokemon can only Dynamax for three turns. During that time, your Dynamax Pokemon can use extremely powerful moves. These max moves not only deal tremendous damage, they can also trigger special effects. The exact effect changes depending on the blah 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 blah. Okay, that doesn't change the fact that this Gossip Floor is going to die in one shot. What did I just say? We had to read that whole two paragraphs for nothing. Alright, now the question is what's his uh, boss signature Pokemon going to be? I have no idea what that is. Uh, Eld Eldegossi. Yeah, Eldegoss. No, I'm not going to switch. So this last one is probably going to Gigantamax on me. Ooh, we're not going to be done in that easy. We're tough as weeds. But you're a grass trainer. What the? Huh, what is this thing? Um, It's probably Gossifleur Evolved. So... I predict he's going to Mega Evolve. Yeah, Mega Evolve. He's going to Dynamax. But because I'm built different, I'm not even going to Dynamax. Come on. It's Dynamax time. You're about to be uprooted. Oh, I'm so scared. Whoa, that's a big Pokeball. Goodness gracious. Oh, okay. All right. This is a... I wasn't expecting all this. Did they just... Oh, yeah. I think they get more health when they do this stuff. Alright, let's see how much my little rabbit can do. Okay, nice. That, that's a three-shot KO. Now, what is this grass thing going to do to me? This will really leave you in shock and awe. It's our Dynamax move. Okay, let's see it. Max Overgrowth. My controller's shaking. Oh, my God. I'm getting blown up by mushrooms right now. That did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. You just changed the terrain on me? Yeah, 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 they definitely did. Okay. Oh, I, okay, cool. <laughs> they just pretty much healed me for free. The grassy terrain and my leftovers, and I haven't even been touched. They're going to get some health back. So I guess they're stuck up there for three turns. I don't care how long they're stuck up there for. That should be a three-shot KO. Oh, actually, they might live this next one. That thing's got a lot of health. Oh, here comes a max overgrowth. That's going to do nothing, though. Cool animation, though. I will give you that, Milo. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 okay. That critical hit did a lot of damage. Um, 
Oh man, how much did that do? I think I can live another crit. I'm not Dynamaxing, I don't need that. That's so 2000 and late. It doesn't matter, it's over. <laughs> I might just keep challenging myself in the future and avoid Dynamaxing. Oh, that was a very majestic cry that it let out. But it's okay, it's over guys. I just destroyed him as I predicted. I will, oh, f Shadow Ball. That's, a, that's really, really, really good. Base 80 power, that's the strongest move I have yet. Wow. Um, okay, I'm going to trade payback for that. Just <laughs> Maybe I could focus energy and sweep somebody's team in the future if needed. Okay, so, so far, this is looking pretty strong for us. Go! Yes. Silly Milo. That was a good battle. The power of grass has wilted. What an incredible gym challenger. Hey, you got to give this man some credit. Like, these gym leaders... They, they, their, their problem is they're, they're always monotype teams. That must have been a fulfilling Pokemon battle for you. As proof that you have defeated a gym leader for the gym challenge, allow me to present you with your very own grass badge. Oh, it's just called the grass badge? I'm cool with that. Usually they, they come up with some ridiculous name. Oh, it's like an amulet. I like that. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 25. Oh... You need eight gym badges to complete the challenge, and the only way to gather badges is to defeat every gym leader. Oh, you remember the beware that eliminated me that one time? It was level 35. That's probably what this means. Um, please accept this TM to commemorate your victory. Magical Leaf. That's a good move. How is that? Like base 60 power or so? It never misses. I, that's, I'll take that, and I got a grass uniform. Oh, something tells me I know where that dragon uniform is going to be at the very, very end of all this. Some advice for you, David. The gym challenge is a set order you'll need to follow. So it means your next stop will be in Holbury to meet Nessa. Holbury's just beyond Route 5. Or since you've got the grass badge, you could head to the wild area. It's a bit tricky to catch Pokemon that are higher level than the Pokemon on your team, but they make powerful allies if you succeed. So, what you're telling me, my friend, is that I can go... Where Where is this? Okay, so I gotta go here. He said you can go through the, the wild area? Are you sure about that, man? I don't know about all that. Hmm. And I'm kind of scared of the wild area after what happened to me last time. Well, there's Route 5 anyway, so I can go ahead and catch a Pokemon or something. Um, wait, what, what was I going to do? Uh, excuse me, uh, I meant to say excuse, excuse moi, which means excuse me. I, I think that means excuse me in French. Um, oh, right, right, right. I can change. I'm, you know, I'm going to put on the grass uniform just to switch up what the kids would call the drip. Where is it? It's not here. So I was lied to. Wait, 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 wait. I think I have it. Can I just change right now, or do I have to go, like, you know, do this decently? And not, uh, get in trouble for public indecency. Where would I- I don't know. Maybe I gotta go find some- one of those things. You know what I'm talking about, one of those things. Okay, cool. Well, let's walk outside. It, yeah, like I was saying earlier, you gotta give these gym leaders some credit, man. Like, they only have monotype teams. Imagine if they could actually, like, you know, if they were, like, the champion, they had- you know, multi-type teams, like Cynthia or something, that'd be scary. Okay, cool, well, wait, are my Pokemon already healed up? Oh yeah, they are. Silly me. I've still only used uh, Mochi, but I think I'm gonna have to change soon, because uh, judging by the looks of things, I think that next gym leader is gonna be a water-type gym leader, so Mochi might not be a... Uh... I think they're gonna be riding backseat for this next one. Yeah, they said Team Yell was making some hoopla over here. Okay, Route 5. Perfect. This will be a perfect stopping point for this video. I just uh, completed the first gym leader thing, so... Um, and, and we got out of there safe and sound. I was almost afraid that Mochi was going to faint back there in that last fight, but... I, it's a fire type, grass type. You know how this goes. Rock, paper, scissors. So, thanks for watching, and I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.